Hey beloveds, welcome to Beanie TV where I offer you sprinkles of spiritual sassiness. What is up my manifesting mama seeders and my miracle minded men? It's been a minute. I had to go on a social media sabbatical and just, you know, take a break. I love y'all, but I love myself more. And I needed to take a break. I needed to take some courses. I needed to see a healer. I needed to get down on my knees and pray. Okay, so I am back full, recharged and ready to be here for you so let's get into today's affirmation today's video is all about the yoni so today's affirmation is going to be about the yoni all right go ahead and close your eyes take a deep breath in release my yoni my choice my yoni my choice my yoni my choice go ahead and take a deep breath in release i didn't even take a deep breath in i'm just so excited to talk to you guys i didn't even take a deep breath in all right guys so let's get into this look okay so this is from forever 21 these braids are by my girl essie i'm gonna leave her uh her instagram in the description box please if you are in the new jersey area come and get your hair done because and she put the things in it for me. She put the little like Nefertiti gold accents in it for me. So I'm really happy about that. Um, uh, can you guys see this blush a little bit? This I'm wearing um, a blush by the Mented Company Black Owned Blush on my face. What? So what does Yoni mean? Yoni is the Sanskrit word for feminine power, for womb for source it is all those things while i was away i took an e-course called break the grip of past lovers by healer jumana sophia when i tell you guys it was a 21 day e-course powerful womb changing i mean really look it up from the it was offered through the dailyom.com i'm gonna leave it all the description in um below and i realized that i haven't really taken care of my yoni i really haven't embraced it fully i embrace being a woman during this lifetime i embrace my femininity but to embrace the womb source your sacral chakra that's where your creativity is i haven't become one with that so this um e-course break the grip of past lovers really helped me to tend to the yoni and i'm so happy to share it with you guys it was it brought me a lot of success in connecting with my womb um so i definitely recommend that for you guys i think you know when i was growing up i had a vagina oh my god i feel like i can't say that word on youtube i had a yoni and the yoni was part of me i was a part of it but not in a like wholesome holy honorable way right like i mistreated my yoni i threw her around she got run over by a truck like just like every part of my body i love being lotioned up okay i love being moist okay so i purchased a few products to help me and my yoni see eye to eye because sometimes she'd be tripping um just to put it all out there for the past four years, I've been having a pH imbalance during my menstrual cycle. Before my menstrual, like the day before my menstrual cycle starts and the last three days of my menstrual cycle, I have a pH imbalance. It was causing me a lot of embarrassment. There was a strong odor coming and I was like, Jesus, this is not, I see what you do for others. This is not <laughs> your covenant with me. So um, I said, you know, I've, I've been battling it for four years. I'm like, I can't do this. I can't do this. Um, so uh, I say that not because I want to like gross anyone out, but I want to be honest and me sharing what I'm going through, I know it's going to help somebody else. So I purchased a few products to help me balance out my yoni. Now, let's be clear. The yoni is a self cleaning organ. Okay. God knows what God did. God intentionally created the yoni. The yoni is self cleaning. Amy Schumer has this hilarious joke where she's like, every single day she takes off her underwear and it looks like she blew her new her nose in the underwear and i'm like same sis same so and that's natural that means that and if it's you know when it's clear when it's uh when it's whitish slightly yellowish um in your underwear it just means your yoni is cleaning itself it's natural anybody who would find that gross you need to grow up and you need to honor this body that you have okay so let's get into the products that have worked that helped me some of them are black owned 
and I am excited to show you guys my Yoni Healing 101 Tings. All right, let's do it. But that's what we're gonna do every time we have a black owned product. We have four products, um, two are black owned. So we're gonna get a Okay, for this, this is <coughs> this is Yoni Goddess Oil from Goddess Body. She is always out of stock of this Yoni oil. Now, I used to use Yoni oil when I lived in LA. The problem with the Yoni oil I used to use was that the herbs were inside of the oil of the container and I was smelling like chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup with a soda on the side. Like I, it was very herby. Okay, and your girl was smelling like Campbell's chicken noodle soup for real. So I don't recommend that brand. I don't even remember what brand it was and we're not gonna recommend it. So this is, it comes out to $30, $30, but you guys know most of my money honestly just goes to wellness products, so whatever. So this was about $30 with tax and shipping and all of that stuff, I believe. Again, it's either 19 or 24, 19 to 24. It's four ounces and it's organic artisanal oil. You can use it for, it's meant for the vag, the vulva. So your uh, labia minora, labia majora, and the opening of the vagina. It is for all of that. It's just like lotioning up your elbows, right? You want to make sure that your elbows are not ashy. The same way you want to take care of your yoni area. You just want to keep it moist. You want to keep it like balanced, okay? So in here you have aloe, you have coconut oil, you've got some uh, boswella, you've got some mira, you have, um, even she adds crystals in here. So you've got nephrite, jade, rose quartz, and, and love, like she, I really like this company, I do. Now, the one thing is that it does take a minute for it to come. Now, it takes two, about two weeks for it to come. I don't, compared to Amazon, that's a long time. But it takes about two weeks to get here and each bottle lasts six months. So you do wanna make sure that you're using it up, okay? Because the, the, the ingredients are very natural. So it does not have that long of a shelf life. But what's great about this is that it restores balance, rids bacterial overgrowth, maintain healthy flora, antibacterial antifungal vaginal toner natural lubricant and youthful essence now I have been using this for about three weeks honestly I love it I love lotioning up my vulva I love like just letting it become an act of self-care for me honestly guys I also use it on my face there's nothing in here that says for yoni only no everything in here you can put on your face you can put on your hair it really is an all-around really great natural product um and my vagina is taking very well to it so i'm so happy to be using this yoni goddess oil and obviously guys I didn't get paid by any of these people. So again, I'm do I'm telling you what has worked for me um, on my Yoni healing journey. Now let's go into the next product. We have the killer. So this is from the company Love Wellness. A little bit of backstory. Love Wellness was created by Lo Bosworth, Lauren Bosworth. Now if anyone remembers Laguna Beach on MTV, that was my show. I have two of the, I have both season one and season two DVD set, Try Me. It is a boric acid suppositories for quick relief for yeast infections and BV symptoms. Now, before I stopped eating meat, before I, um, before when I used to eat terribly and I used to eat a lot, a lot of candy, I was always having yeast infections. I was having yeast infections, I believe from latex condoms and I was having yeast infections from um just certain partners and just you know not taking care of down there so this is made from medical grade boric acid fda inspected facility so we're not just shoving any old thing up into our holy place right suppository oh let me just show you guys you take the suppository and you put it up all the way up in as far as it can go into your vaginal canal now, if you, like me, are having an imbalance at the end of your period, I would suggest adding a little bit of lubricant. Um, I would suggest a little bit of coconut oil 
to put it up all the way up there because you guys know blood can is sticky especially during the last years of your period you're not really like shedding that much of your uterine lining so my mistake you guys this channel is all about learning from my mistakes basically um so the mistake i made was trying to shove it up there on one of the last days of my period and that really hurt so i had to use <laughs> use my vaginal muscles to push out the um to push out the suppository and then i was like okay that really hurt i'm not gonna do that again and then i took a little bit of coconut oil lubricated it and then put it right back up there you're gonna want to do this at night lying down so you'll see that you know it's best to wear a panty liner while you're taking the boric acid um because it is gonna be releasing you know getting you know just stuff is gonna be falling out so it says that you can use for seven days for chronic irritation and up to 14 days or use as a spot treatment if needed me I'm, i use it as a spot treatment so and it worked okay let's like the point is that it worked the, the last menstrual cycle i had thanks to the boric acid i did not encounter a ph imbalance or any odor or anything like that so i thank god for that and um i use one suppository at the beginning and one suppository at the end and it really just it worked and that's what it's about right like i'm not gonna show you guys something that i haven't tried out that i don't stand by that you know doesn't work it works so i highly recommend it it's either 19 or 24 dollars but just go over to lovewellness.com they are amazing they are great let them know beanie tv sent you and um yeah let's move on to the next product so let's talk about honey pot but at that 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 so for women by women black owned vaginal care company leo's name is bia and basically she was suffering from bacterial vaginosis for years and one day an ancestor came to her in a dream and gave her the ingredients to start the honeypot company they make pads they make vaginal washes they wipes and um this was the first product that i introduced my yoni to and literally every single time i use this I just feel like extra just extra clean and I don't want to say it that way because I really am against the idea that you have to clean or make your vagina smell good no like God was like the yoni is gonna smell this way and it's gonna be a self-cleaning machine so anything that promotes like uh, taking away odor I'm not for it but I will say that again this is a sensitive wash which is exactly what I need and again it's just part of my self-care I love taking showers I love lotioning up I love taking baths and to add that extra step in my self-care routine especially such an intimate beautiful part of my body like why not so this is $8.99 you can find it at Target as well as the honeypot.co my favorite thing is that it contains colloidal silver which is known to just be antifungal antibacterial and all around this product just gets you back on it gets you back in balance with your 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 yoni's natural self um, it is foamy and it doesn't smell like anything i got the one that yeah it doesn't smell like anything this is again the sensitive wash it has lavender villander villander <laughs> it has lavender vinegar and calendula um i love being able to support black businesses and even if you're not black you should still be supporting black businesses because they're just as good as any other business so um if you purchase this product i know you're gonna like it um, and i use it every day i use it every day gentle sensitive sometimes i'll skip a day but i use it every day and um when you buy this product not if but when you buy this product let them know beanie tv sent you we've got good girl probiotics by again love wellness we already talked about them with the killer now um you guys know i've been using probiotics to with my for my vaginal health for a couple years months now and i love it my body loves it and so i'm gonna keep doing it so these are the good girl probiotics stay balanced down there or get back on track after an infection or irritation i do not take this every day i probably should but i don't um i heard it's really good to take this on an empty stomach first thing in the morning 
Again, I don't. But I do take this when I am on my period to keep things balanced. Your gut, your stomach, what you eat, your digestive system is your second brain. Everything that you put into your digestive system affects everything in your body. Really, it should be the first brain. But your gut is the second brain. If you eat a lot of candy, it affects your vagina. If you eat a lot of uh, sugar or, or cheeses or meat products, all of it is affecting your yoni. So be mindful. Um, one of my friends was saying like, you know, it's really important to eat a lot of vegetables the week before your period so that you're not cramping as much, so that you're not, um, if you're a heavy bleeder, it alleviates a lot of bleeding. So be mindful and let your, your, let your menstrual cycle be a harmonious situation. Even when you're PMSing, call it out and be like, all right, I know I'm PMSing. I see you PMS. Come on, let's go on this ride. You know what I mean? Like be in control of what is going to be happening to you until you're like in your 50s and 60s you know enjoy the ride while you can now when i got this i was like oh that is some strong good um probiotics bacteria that's some good bacteria they had to put two like three or four cotton swabs in here because the smell is so strong but that just means that it's good bacteria so my only thing about this is that the capsules are gelatin gelatin comes from pigs we're in the body and instead of vegetable capsules i do hope that they one day switch to vegetable capsules so if you're a strict vegan this really isn't the product for you but if you're not a strict vegan and um, you don't mind the gelatin capsules then this is for you so i thank you guys so much for tuning into this yoni health 101 if you have any questions please feel free to dm me at beanie tv on instagram send me an email at beanie tv yo at gmail.com i'm sending you and your yoni so much love and goodness and awesomeness and beauty and healing wherever you need it for the month of September, I am going to be giving my one hour soul sessions for free. Okay. So DM me, email me if you would like to book a session. Basically, it's just going to be us talking and giving, and I'm going to give you practical spiritual practices to assist you in whatever we decide to cover during our consultation. And I'm also giving away the first book in my self-development e-course uh, and I am so excited to be giving y'all this because I know that it is helpful I know that it's amazing and it's powerful and I just want you guys to feel amazing and powerful also I am selling shea butter and if you would like to purchase some shea butter go ahead and DM me on Instagram I love you guys I miss you guys for all of my yonis out there we got this and we have to talk more about imbalances odors you know understanding that if one person's going through it someone else is going through it and by sharing the kind of embarrassing things we can help each other make it not so embarrassing because it's not like it's actually not embarrassing and it's not gross we just live in a patriarchal society that makes us believe that our you know yonis are supposed to smell like roses like no my yoni is gonna smell how it smells and this is self cleaner we're not gonna fall for any of that we don't need extra fragrance we don't need anything actually causing more imbalance in the yoni we don't need any of that so thank you guys so much when you pro when you purchase these products tag me on instagram or facebook or whatever and let me and the the uh honey pot and love wellness and goddess body let them know that i sent you to them okay thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you guys next video peace